good evening. If you have a student, a child who is in kindergarten and first grade, they should be making their way back to the cafeteria. If you have an orchestra student, hopefully they've already been with Mr. Knackley in the orchestra room.
Happy evening, everyone. I'm Mrs. Ryan, and I have the privilege of being the principal here at Conewago, and you guys are in for a real treat tonight. These kids have worked really hard. And just a couple announcements that we would really like to put out a heartfelt thanks to Mr. Mackley, Mr. Rao, and Mrs. Clements for the hours that they put in to make sure that this concert is a wonderful experience for the kids and for you. So the kids got to practice today. Um, and so the second and the third graders were able to listen and they were absolutely amazed and they really enjoyed the concert, so I know you will as well. Now, a couple of housekeeping items. Please make sure you turn off your cell phones. If any of the siblings get into a screaming fit a little bit, we just ask that you take them out so that it does not disrupt the, the singers and the performers up here. But the most important thing is at the end, Yes, you must collect your children at the end. <laughs> we love them and I will see them bright and early tomorrow morning, but they are going home. <laughs> but to make sure that they get back to their room safely, I am going to ask that nobody moves when the songs are done. When the concert's over, everybody needs to stay in their seats. I know some of you try to beat the traffic out but unfortunately, we are going to take our kindergartners through the audience and out the doors into the cafeteria. If you guys get up and start to move, I cannot guarantee you that you are going to not interrupt that flow and we need to make sure that our kids get back to where they are so we can make sure that they get to you safely tonight. Also, I know that you wanna give them a lot of love, but please only send one person to go collect your child. Um, as you know, that cafeteria is full. It's about 200 kids in there. So if I add all of you in there, no one's getting out. So please only send one person. All right, well, that's enough for the announcement. I'm gonna pass this over to Mr. Nackley and sit back and enjoy the show. Good evening, everybody. My name is James Knackley, and I am the third grade orchestra teacher at Northeastern. There are some wonderful, wonderful students behind me, and they're very excited to show you their spring concert presentation. Third graders at Northeastern have the honor and privilege of being able to play a string instrument, um, which is really, really special for them to learn at the, the age of, of uh, how old are you? <laughs> Eight or nine. <laughs> so. Um, the first song that they're going to be playing is a song called Native American Melodies, and they learned how to use their bows in these songs.
The second song that they learned is a very common um, folk song called Hot Cross Buns. And so the students learned how to pluck their strings using a technique called pizzicato. And then they learned how to bow the strings with a technique called arco. The next melody that they learned is an American fiddle tune called Boil em Cabbage Down. And they will follow the same pattern where they'll pluck the melody and then bow the melody. Thank you. 
Before the third graders play their last piece for you, I just want to take a minute to recognize all of the accomplishments of the students on stage. They have some ribbons on their instruments. Third graders, can you hold up your instruments so that the audience can see them? These ribbons represent belts in our orchestra karate belt challenge program where students learn songs and they do a test on them to earn a ribbon. And so we have lots and lots of ribbons that were earned this year. And the highest belt of the year is the black belt. And I want to acknowledge one of our students who had, did earn his black belt this year on the cello. And Andrew Murren, can you stand up so that everyone can acknowledge your achievement? And can we give a round of applause for all the students for their ribbons they've earned this year? All right, our last piece for today is the Batman theme song. And so the students will use their bows, they will pluck, and please enjoy Batman. I'm super proud of the kids. They've done an awesome job and looking forward to hopefully having lots of these kindergartners and first graders when they hit third grade to play a string instrument. We're gonna have a quick stage change and then we'll move on to the rest of the program.
All right, good evening. We are going to be bringing in our kindergarten and first grade singers. Um, our kindergarten friends are actually going to be coming down through the aisles, so please leave that aisle open so that they can get through safely. Thank you. Good evening. My name is Mrs. Clements, and I am one of the music teachers at Conewago. We also have Mr. Rao, who is our other music teacher, and we also have Miss Oliveri here, who is my student teacher this year. Uh, we are so uh, happy that you are with us tonight on this beautiful, beautiful night. Uh, our kindergarten and first grade students have worked so hard the last couple of weeks on, on this program. So please, I know you're excited, they're excited, but if we could keep it as quiet as possible so they can hear us um, and be focused on us so that we can put on the best program we can put on, we would really appreciate that. All right, so we are going to begin our, our concert entitled Brown Bear, Brown Bear, What Do You See? Kindergarten, first grade, check your feet. Check your hands, eyes, 
smiles. Here we go. see a red bird looking at me. looking at me.
Green frog, green frog, what do you see? I see a white dog looking at me. Goldfish looking at me. looking at me.
All right. Uh, before we do our last two pieces, I would like to first uh, put out some thank yous. Um, first of all, I want to thank our high school tech sound booth. Um, they are rock stars. They really pull through and come uh, put a lot of time into our concerts, and we really appreciate everything that they do for us. So high school tech, you guys are awesome. And parents, thank you also for all of your support. Or support. Um, I know there's a lot of things going on at this time of the year, so we really appreciate you bringing your kids here on such uh, nice evenings. So we really appreciate you coming out and supporting the music department and the music program here at Northeastern. Also, kids, you guys are awesome. You are doing a fabulous job. I'm so proud of you. Aren't they wonderful? So thank you, kids. Thank you. Awesome job. And my last thank you goes to uh, Mrs. Ryan and all of the staff and teachers that came out this, this evening also to help. Um, I, we can't put this program on without all of their help and their support. So thank you from the bottom of my heart for coming out and helping us um, with tonight's show. So thank you. And finally, yeah, thank you, teachers. <laughs> And finally, I also want to thank my student teacher. Uh, she has been with me for about a year now. Um, she did her official student teaching this spring with us, and she has just been so amazing to have, and I can't thank her enough for everything that she has brought to our school. So she actually wanted to say a word or two, so I'm going to let her, because, hey, she's learning how to do this. So here you go. Hi guys, um, so like Mrs. Clemens said, uh, I am her student teacher. I've been with these kiddos for uh, several weeks, but I actually got to meet them last year, some of them, and they just astound me every day. They're all such wonderful, amazing kiddos, and I just wanna thank all you parents for making them that way, so thank you. And I also wanna thank everyone at Conewago, all the teachers for making me feel welcome and a part of the staff uh, the past few weeks that I have been student teaching. So I also want to just thank the kids because they've been doing a fabulous job. You guys are rocking it, right? You're going to keep going strong with these last few songs? Yeah? Who's excited? All right, so I guess I'll wrap that up because they look like they're ready to sing. All right, kindergarten. We are going to end our program with our last two songs. children singing to me. I'm going to do that one again. Yellow duck, yellow duck, what do you see? I, I see a teacher looking at me.
Teacher, teacher, what do you see? I see children singing to me. Children, children, what do you see? We see red bird, green frog, white dog, goldfish, yellow duck, teacher, parents all cheering for me. That's what I see. All right, as Mrs. Ryan explained, we are going to be leaving the auditorium, so please just stay in your seats until we get all of the students off of the stage. Thank you, and have a great evening. We will let you know when all of the students are back, and you may go get your child.
have made it back to the cafeteria. So just a reminder, can you only send one person to go pick up your child? You're going to go in, you're going to find their table and sign them out, and then they are yours to collect and you're free to take them. Thank you all for coming to our concerts.